sorry guys. We keep telling my husband that we need to get out of here. We need to get out of here and he's... What's going on? I just want to make sure that was recording. And it's like he's saying, so you want hamburgers and pizza? I'm like, we just need to get out of here. I don't care. Anything is fine. Let's just eat. Let's just go because we're getting pummeled here. You know, stuff burns your skin. We're getting very immune to it too, but I had a very bad day yesterday for some reason. Apparently he did hear us. Oh. I'm not sure why he was acting like he didn't. Whatever. Was it a quarter? Oh, I'm sorry. Quarter. What? Wait, why can't I get this up? So anyway, guys, I I'm gonna go rescue us because this is inhumane. We should not have been treated this way at all. We never agreed to this. We agreed to coming forward with our dissertation, us personally presenting our stuff to the Senate or whoever, and uh, witness as a witness. And there's witness protection programs. There's all of these things. And I'm like, wait a minute, none of this is being done? Come on. You know something is very wrong when that happens. So that's what the whole rescue is supposed to be for, so we can be protected because while all this other shit was going on and instead we were being used as leverage and used as a device and a tool to get information out and I'm like you know what I'm done getting the information out I could do that in the safe place of protection out of here you know and my lineage and roots come from another country and I'm pretty sure that they're pretty pissed off I don't like how my second dad pushes people so hard to the point where they're ready to just end it all. I don't think that's cool. I push people hard, but I don't push them to the point where they want to say, that's it. Nothing is worth that. You know what I'm saying? Your life is more valuable than to drive you crazy to, you know, to the point where you don't even want to be around anymore. That, that, that is abuse. You know, and I'm, I'm, I'm not down for that. I, I don't like being treated this way. And I don't want to treat people this way. Sometimes you got to put your foot down when people do something wrong. But we haven't done anything wrong. We've done everything right, and we've done everything above and beyond. And you know what? We need to get, we need to get some good stuff now. We need to get the support where people are not afraid to, you know, go on our Twitter and say, "At a girl." Noel, you did a great job coming forward with this. You know, we need to be at that point because this is old. People are done. People are tired. People are not giving a shit about the cues anymore. People are that brave. And it, they may have come to that decision because they're just so fucking tired of this. Fine. Some of them are like, oh my God, this poor girl and her son, you know, it's like, what the hell is going on? You know, and you all have different reasons. Some of you don't want to live under Q's bullshit anymore. Whatever, I don't care. As long as we all get there on the same boat at the same time, loving on one each other, no backstabbing, okay? That's why we need to know the truth of what's going on. And I don't like being used like this. I never agreed to this. It's a bad idea. Bad idea. And I kept saying, don't do this. I said, don't use us for this. We're not down for the. I don't know how many times we've said it verbally, tweeted it, sent emails, and, you know, don't, because we, we're not down. We need a rescue. And it seemed like other people were betrayed, thinking that that's what the thing was supposed to be for. So now, just make it happen. Just make it happen. Just make it happen. We have leverage now. Let's be kind with it, though, okay? It's more our leverage than your guys' leverage, though. So remember that. And we're going to watch you guys and make sure you don't do anything funny. So, we know we're going to get even more protection now. Now that everybody knows the true story. 
I'm thanking you. I'm not going to backstab you. If you're doing the right thing, you have nothing to worry about. If you're doing the wrong thing, lawsuit. That's got to be the bottom line, guys. I, we can't do this anymore. We're getting sick. You know what I mean? It's hot. I need to take care of my son. I need him to be in a very regimented way. You know, it, it helps. It helps a lot. And uh, I, I can't make normalcy happen when we're running for our lives. We didn't want to run for our lives, but what do we do? We were doing all the right things, contacting our government, saying this is happening, our landlord, and nobody is really helping us. They just did steps, but it's like the problem's still here. So, no duh, you know, infrastructure, our infrastructure's 